Hi folks, hope you're okay today, it's good to be with you. I just want to talk about uh, Matthew um, 28 verse 19. It says, Go ye therefore and teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. Now, Muslim apologist in Hyde Park will bring to your attention that this passage they would say is not in the original of Matthew. They would say that there are earliest manuscripts that we haven't got it in. So it's not in the earliest manuscripts. Eusebius doesn't quote it. Uh, he only quotes a short version. And in the book of Acts, you know, it doesn't quote baptized in the name of the Father, Son and the Holy Spirit, but only in the name of the Son. So it's not original. How do we answer that? Well, in the earliest manuscripts, we have fragments. They're not full Gospel of Matthew. We only have few manuscripts. Uh, we only have fragments. Like we might have chapter 5 or chapter 3 or chapter 1. So obviously, if you've only got a fragment that's chapter 1, you haven't even got chapter 2, chapter 3, chapter 4, let alone chapter 28, verse 19. So it's a false argument to say the earliest manuscripts, we don't have the last part of this passage of Matthew in. No, the earliest manuscripts we have are fragments, so all the manuscripts that we have that are full Matthew, we have the last ending of Mark. That's why Bart Ehrman, who's a skeptic and critique of the Bible, says that it's an authentic passage, because no one questions it, because it's in all the manuscripts of Matthew, full manuscripts. Secondly, when, you, when they say Eusebius only quoted a part, uh, only quoted uh, a part of it, didn't quote all of it, Eusebius quotes this passage 19 times. He quotes a shorter version 16 times and then 3 times uh, a, the larger full version. So he does quote the full version. But Eusebius has the habit of shortening passages and quoting them in shorthand. So just because he quoted a passage in shorthand doesn't mean to say he doesn't agree with the full passage. And so he does quote the full passage in full in his 19 times that he does quote 16 times he quotes short short uh, this passage in a short way and then three times in a long way so you can't use Eusebius to say that uh, it's not in Matthew okay so all the manuscripts do have uh, this passage uh, Eusebius does quote this passage and then thirdly uh, the early church fathers, uh, like uh, in the Didache and other writers, Tertullian and others, quote, Father, Son and Holy Spirit. So it's even attested in the early church. And then finally, when it quotes the book of Acts, that is shorthand, when it says in the name of Jesus, that is shorthand for Father, Son and Holy Spirit. Okay, thank you for listening and God bless you.